it going guys? Welcome back to another episode of Pack to the Future, episode number three today. Episode number two was uploaded really, really late on Thursday night, um, simply because I couldn't get a thumbnail for the video. However, even though I uploaded it really, really late, you guys smashed almost, I said thank you for 500 likes, you guys almost smashed 800 likes. I'm going to set a new challenge for you guys. If we could smash 1,000 likes on today's episode of Pack to the Future, that would be... Mind blowing. Anyway, let's get straight into today's episode then. Um, you'll have seen it yesterday. I'm gonna ruin it for you right now. So if you've not seen yesterday's episode, get off this video. Um, we got a new striker and it was a really, really nice striker. That being said, we picked up the one and only Wilfred Zaha. Both games in yesterday's episode, he managed to get involved in four goals, scoring three of those goals he was involved in. Really nice striker. Hopefully, he's going to be in our squad for quite a while. We've made some nice improvements to the squad. However, you guys are still putting in the comments, do SBCs as soon as you can do them. We don't have a crazy amount of players right now. We can do, however, let's keep going. You get a premium reward loan player, I believe it is. Very, very easy SBCs here, you will see. Before we do get into these SBCs, you will see in the top corner... I have gone down to 2,200 coins. I don't want anyone in this series to think I cheat. The whole point of this series is to have fun. And if I was cheating, I would not be having fun. The coins have gone into um, position changes for the players that I'm about to show you. For example, first owner, lovely stuff. Uh, first owner, lovely stuff. I believe this guy was a cam. We had to move him up to a centre forward to get up to that 43 chemistry we needed. Um, as I've, I've said in the rules of this series, you're allowed to buy consumables. Consumables are absolutely allowed to be bought. You just can't buy players. And we've actually been given two there. I actually needed that one. There was a left wing to left forward, which I'm about to show you guys we needed. Here, um, I didn't have any left forwards in the club, uh, so we had to use left wingers and right wingers. We had to convert them to a right forward and left forward. That being said, we had to go onto the market and buy some um, position changes. They did cost a little bit, but as you can see here, three players, all first owner. Absolutely lovely stuff. No cheating. I'll never cheat in this series because that just ruins the whole point of this series and it's no fun for me if I'm cheating. Perfect links then here. We had to get two players from the same club which we managed to do. Uh, just uh, no, do not clear that. Uh, just in case anybody's doubtful that um, I've been buying players. There you can see both first owner, one tradable, one untradable. Um, another player from the same league and then we needed a centre back and a right back from the same league. We went with the Mexican league with two silver players. You can see here um, both first owner. Absolutely lovely stuff. So we needed 40 chemistry on that one. That one was a little bit hard. I think that was the hardest of the four today. Um, and then finally, guys, we've got loyal lads. You need three players, same nationality, three different leagues. So I decided to go with Argentinian simply because then we could use a bronze player. So we're using this guy, first owner. We are then using Higuain, first owner. And then we are going with someone from the Serie A also a first owner. All these guys, all the golds that I've submitted here, guys, we'll never ever use. Um, they're either terrible, terrible, terrible cards, or it's just a league or nation that I will never touch. So let's keep going. That's a uh, that's actually, I suppose, like our first set of SBCs done in Pack to the Future. So we now have six packs to open. Obviously, they're not all great. We do also have a uh, custom esports team kit pack. I believe everyone in the game gets this. I got it last night when the servers were having a little bit of difficulty. Uh, this is all the pro FIFA team uh, teams, I should say, pro teams. This is their kits for the season. So we've got the likes of Hashtag, Team Liquid in there. Who else do I need? Uh, team Envy, SK is in there, Footwiz is in there. Um, so yeah, guys, everyone will get those. So if that's something you're interested in, whack them on a, as your active kit and you will have all your... Well, I hope you guys are getting loads of walkouts because I'm not getting many walkouts this year on FIFA 19. Don't know what it is. I just feel like pack weight is completely different compared to FIFA 18. A lot harder to pack good players. So anyway, getting through these packs then. These are all the packs that we just managed to get as a reward for the SBCs we've just submitted. As I said, they're all bronze players, guys. But as you've just seen in the SBC we submitted, we do use bronze players. So even though like they're terrible packs, they will become useful for us in SBCs later on down the line. 
prime example being today. We got coins, we got consumables out of it. That is rude. That is rude. Wow, Dick from the Bundesliga 2, I believe that is. German right back. What a name that is. What a name, Dick. Uh, right, where are we up to then? Uh, two silver player pack, and then we'll open that premium loan player. The loan player could become very valuable for us, especially considering our Aguero yesterday did run out of contracts. Um, so now we are having to use Zaha with Sturridge up front. We'll do a quick run through of the squad before we do get into today's game. Here we are then, guys. This is our reward for the SBC we just completed. Let's get, what was it called? Let's get going, let's get started, or something like that. Right, so we're getting an 81 to an 85 rated player here. Don't give me an 81, 82, 83. I want an 84, or actually I would take an 83 actually, something like Martial, I suppose. Birdie. Not too bad. Not too bad. He's got a one to watch card this season. Um, you could have got your hands on him for free if you completed the weekly objective. His base card so far isn't actually bad. <clears throat> If you've played with him, five star, uh, yeah, five star weak foot. I was correct in saying that. High medium, pacey. I believe his finishing isn't too bad. Wow, his finishing's actually terrible. You had to score goals with him to get his one to watch as a weekly objective, and I think I scored two hat tricks with him. I would never have guessed his finishing was that low. I actually quite liked his card. As you can see. 92 agility, 90 balance, 86 ball control, 84 dribbling, 84 curve, uh, 84 free kick accuracy. 88 acceleration. That's not too bad of a card. So we'll be probably putting him onto the subs bench. Ooh, no, I just saw. Promo packs. Oh no, the 25s have disappeared. Okay, that's a little bit annoying. Right, this is the squad then, guys. We are going to be using for today's episode. Let me just triple check. Oh, do you know what I was going to do at the end of last episode? We were going to do this. Yes, don't show me that again. What we were going to do is, we were going to make some changes, I remember now. Oh, yeah, okay, so we got a Premier League goalkeeper. That gives us a massive boost in chemistry. Uh, and then we were going to put in Ndidi. Uh, Ayute, you are, you're high medium, so you should probably, your passing's terrible. All right, we'll put you there. You there. And is Key our best option? Oh, that puts us up to 90 chemistry. That is nice. We'll put on the bench. We'll put Walcott onto the bench, actually. And then these two can just go into the club. That's our squad as it stands, guys, for the start of episode number three. It's not terrible, by any means. It could have been a lot, lot worse. We've managed to get up to 90 chemistry already. However... The players aren't amazing. The players are not amazing at all. If we can get Kayute to a centre mid. Can we get a cheap one? Do expired. Did I save the coins? Just in case we might need like a squad fitness or something. Okay, that is the squad, guys. We're going to be jumping into game number one with for today's episode. Let's jump. Where do we stand, actually? Let me update you guys. We... Uh, this is this is our last division rivals placement match, guys. So after this first game now, we're going to get placed in a division in rivals. I don't want to get placed high. If anything, it would make sense to lose the game on purpose. Then we'd have to discard packs. Okay. Right, anyway, let's jump into game number one, guys, of the episode. Let's check out our opposition squad. Here's our opposition then, guys. Epi uh, game number one. So here's something quite interesting. I was saying to Nepenthes and Bateson last night, how does matchmaking for division rivals placement work? No one actually has a clue, but there is no way that this guy here is in placements. There is no way. I refuse to accept and believe that this guy who has UEFA Champions League cater, I believe that was, and player of the month, Lucas, so he, he was playing FIFA in the first month of the game because otherwise he wouldn't have been able to get Player of the Month Lucas. So I don't know why we're matching up against these people in our placement games. Come on, Zaha. Zaha, can he give us the 1-0 here? Yes, he has. There it is. Wilfred Zaha once again 
beat uh, Daviton Sanchez, I believe that was. Threw and go, really nice angle, but he's right-footed, Zaha. Well, At least I think he is. If he's not, then that was one hell of a finish. A keeper probably should have done better. I think he's got Edison in goal. Yeah, but hey, I'm not complaining. There. Fifth minute. With uh, giving me the ball from kickoff as well. Oh, look at the space here for our... Look at this. Can he get the finish off? What a save by Edison. He's made up for uh, conceding that goal versus Zaha. Good ball as well, actually. Ah. Poor header. Oh, no, look at this. Player of the Month, Lucas versus our Will Keane. Or Michael Keane, Will Keane. There's the equaliser. Ah, no. Player of the Month, Lucas hurts us really, really badly. Sigurdsson from Everton getting the equaliser against us there in the 26th minute. It has, however, before that goal, it's been all us. So I'm not. Should have scored that. We really, really should have scored that. A nice bit of kickoff cheese for us. Put us on a little one and one. Lost his cheek. Now here's a chance to get at the opposition. Didn't want it to stop, did they? And the referees quite clearly. Brought us down there. We're, we're getting loads of attacks against this guy. We're not really getting the finishing product off. Yeah, but that player involved will have to be careful from now on. He's in the last chance saloon. Oh no, I wanted to. That is what I wanted, but I wanted the player I passed it to to pass it on again. Oh no. Oh wow. Oh wow, we've got away with death there, boys. We have really, really got away with death there. Kept dropping down to him, but luckily, the header from Cater, I believe that was, was wide. Surely. I see you back stick. Oh, why is that? Will clear the danger. Oh, ref, you can't blow the whistle there. What an unfortunate time for the whistle to go for us. Right, as you can see from the stats, guys, I have had a lot. I've had double the chances that my opposition has had. We've had more possession, much better pass accuracy, and he's got a much better team than me. Um. Right, last time we put this guy up front, he scored for us, and I'm also going to put Rabia at. Cam, very tall. Uh, he's got attacking work rate, so that's why we're putting him in the cam spot and not anywhere else. Ndidi, by the way, has had a brilliant game for us. Absolute brilliant game. One or half time. Come on, man. We we can get, we can take the lead. I know we can. Oh no! How has he got the shot off there? I thought I got the challenge in. All right, we're two one down, boys. Eighty four rated Champions League cater. Taking the lead from our position. Come on. Undeserved. But then again, I've not taken my chances. Oh my goodness me. Oh my goodness me. We just missed an open goal. Oh, it's Rabiot. Surely. Please, Rabiot. He's very slow, so he was going to get caught up there by the defence. I had to take the shot. And in it goes. We've hit the we've hit the crossbar. Come on, what is this game? Oh, it's his free kick as well. Oh, there's still time. There's still plenty of time in this game. when he was denied with what was a great effort. We've hit the crossbar again. We've hit the crossbar again. No way, surely. Oh, come on, man. Against the run of play completely, guys. We've gone 3-1 down. Unbelievable finish from uh, Sigurdsson there. Zaha. Good vision. Got one back from kickoff. Come on. Shot gets blocked. It's a good place to win the ball here. Shots on here. It's just wide. Rabiot, five minutes to go, guys. I'm gonna go ultra attacking here because we need a goal, otherwise we're gonna be discarding packs. Rabiot. It's all the back run post there. 
That post run. Have we picked up? Have we picked up a yellow? What have we done? Come on, we deserve a win here. I know this is just for a draw. Man, what an undeserved loss on the record that is, guys. What an undeserved loss that is. We controlled that game brilliantly. We made so many more chances. The defense was just way, way too tough. Who did he have? Eric Bailly and Davison Sanchez. We just struggled too much against that defense, guys. So, unfortunately, we have taken another loss on the series. Look at that. 16 shots, 8 on target, better possession, much better pass accuracy. How many saves did our opposition's goalkeeper make? Let's have a look. Our keeper made one save. Terrible. Edison made eight. I mean, that's what you get, guys, with an 86-rated goalkeeper. That does, however, I think that places us now. Let's see where we place. Is it going to show us? We won three out of the five. Let's put us in Division 5. What? We're going to get obliterated, guys. We are going to get absolutely smashed to shreds. What, what are we going to do? How has that put us up so high? Right, anyway, guys, that does mean we have three 7.5k packs to discard here. Don't give me anything decent, please, game. I can't believe that's put us in Division 5. I won 5 out of 5, and it put me in Division 4 on my main account. We just won 3 out of 5. That's put us in Division 5. Oh, we're going to get absolutely stomped. Right, pack number one there. I don't mind discarding that at all. 1,300. Can't believe it. I actually am, like, slightly sat here in shock. Anyway. It's a rare this time. That's fine. Don't have a problem discarding that. Zero complaints from me. A lot of players in there. 2,000, yeah, there was a lot of players in there. 2,600 coins we got for that discard. Right, final one to discard then, guys, for losing 3-2. It's not an 86 rated player, thank goodness. It's not a board, thank goodness. It's another Mexican. Guys, EA have been very good to us with those packs, to be fair. Three absolutely stinking packs, which I don't mind changing whatsoever. Uh, don't mind discarding. What I was about to say is... Oh, man, what the... How, what are we going to do? What are we actually going to do, guys? Completed a weekly objective. Unfortunately, it doesn't give us a player. It gives us a stand-up to cancer uh, kit. Uh, all for a good cause. We need some weekly objectives. Spies in one hour, 41 minutes. We're not gonna, we don't even have a Dutch player to score well, six separate rival matches. That's three episodes. Ooh, hello. If we get, if we win one more game, guys, we'll get a swap deals player. No changes to be made to the squad. Let's jump into game number two of the episode. Let's check out our opposition squad. Right, we've been placed into Division 5. <laughs> These teams are so good, guys. If you've got any suggestions on how to survive Division 5 with a really terrible team, put it in, put it in the comments, guys, because I'm going to need help here. I really am going to need help. Really anticipating something special from him here today. 26 goals. Fantastic ball. Oh, wow. Sturridge, take a bow, my friend. Fantastic goal. We've gone 1-0 up in the ninth minute with our first attack. I want to watch the replay there because that was actually a really, really nice replay. A uh, really nice goal. Look at that. No, you didn't. I mean, he's a cool head and he's one that... you got Leno in goal as well. Leno, mate. See you later, my friend. Daniel Sturridge. Let's go, buddy. Oh, he's turned us. Oh, what a finish. Fantastic finish. My opposition absolutely skimmed us there. With Jao Moutinho. Wow. I just got sent to the shops by Jao Moutinho. Oh my goodness me, this is so hard, guys. I'm truly, like, try hard in here. 
nearly scored an own goal there. Rashford and Mares are tearing us to shreds on the wings. I'm just trying to get the ball to... I'm just trying to get the ball to Zaha and I'm just trying to get through with Zaha but kind of a one-man mission. And ourselves a penalty. Chris Smalling with his old haircut there. And I'm bad at pens. I'm not excited. You can probably tell, guys, why you're not excited. You've got a pen to go 2 and up. I'm terrible at pens. Daniel Sturridge pens versus... Oh, we've actually scored it. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Daniel Sturridge is on that brace. Oh, I tried to get another cheesy pen there. Right, half time, guys. We're 2 1 up. Whoops. Skip the stats. Um, let's go to the match facts then, just to have a look at how things are going. Dead even, to be fair. On the, the stats, chances created. My opposition's had a little bit better possession than us. Pass accuracy. How have I got 90% pass accuracy almost with such a terrible squad? <sighs> who knows? Who knows? Right, we're going to have to make some changes here. Um, you know what? I might put... Yeah. All right, let's put Jesse Rodriguez at the cam... Did I get that done in time? I don't actually know if I got that done in time. I'm going to have to pause it again. Be sure. We didn't. Okay, thank goodness. Uh, let's put Jesse Rodriguez in that cam spot. And we won't change... Actually, we will change the attack. Yeah, we will. We'll take off Sturridge. Uh, and we'll put on this guy. I keep putting him on, by the way, guys, because he's very, very quick. 21 sprints. He's not as quick as this guy, though. Garney. All right, okay. It's his debut as well. So, um, well, it's both their debuts. So, if we do score with them, guys, we'll be able to get bonus packs. Surely, surely he's on. It's a fine a goal. He's on! Come on! I thought he was offside, the player that failed the first chance. But Key was there for the rebound. What a finish, by the way. Really nice finish there from Key. I want to see the replay again of this. He had the tightest angle to get the ball in. Look, first time finish as well. Just managed to squeeze it in. Yes! Come on! One more attack. He's given it away. Here we are. Real chance. How's that offside? A chance to really get in at the goalkeeper. Running off oh, the that was our well chance. Offside. We've blown it. Oh, well. We've, we've still picked up the win, guys. We have still managed to pick up the win there. Second game of the episode. 3-1. No more discards. I think if Zaha getting man of the match, even though he didn't score. Oh, he got two assists that game. Well played. 3-1 win there. And as you can see from the stats... Arguably deserved, considering we had a much, much, much worse team. Arguably deserved. Let me know down in the, in the comments. Is that a deserved win, do you reckon? I don't know. Maybe I'm just being ridiculously biased. Let's see how that has done for us. You know, um, let's see how it's done for us in uh, 65. Okay, so we get 65 foot chance points every win in Division 5. Uh, our skill rating... Okay, our skill rating is not that high at 1,200. 240 points. 530 points. Is that it? Okay, so we're in rank 3. We're in rank 3. So let's see, guys. On Thursday, we'll be getting rewards for rank 5. So at the minute, it's 2 mega packs and 4... Oh, wow, well, that's actually pretty decent. Jumbo premium. That's actually very good. What the hell? Ooh, we could get to rank one. We could get to rank one. That would mean we get some really, really nice rewards on Thursday. And we, of course, have just got our first foot swap deal player. Who is it? I can't remember who it is. I did do it on my main account. Oh, yes. It's actually a, uh, it's a silver from, it's Stevens from Southampton, from the Prem. That's what I was originally trying to say, from the Prem. I don't know if we can submit that because it does expire. Oh, wait. Uh, if it's foot swaps. Is there one that fires one? 
Because you once this finishes, guys, you won't ever be able to use them again. Uh, um, that silver pack require one. It does. So do you know what, guys? We are going to use that Stevens. Why is it not showing? Because where on earth is he? Let's just go special goal. Oh wait, he's not a goalkeeper, is he? He's a centre back. Why why did I think we had just packed a goalkeeper? I genuinely cannot I don't know why. That was... Right, okay. We are gonna submit that guys. You can only use these all last month, which expire in like I think it's like two hours. So we're gonna submit that there. We get a silver pack for that, and of course, winning that game at 3-1, we now get to go and open three packs as well. Come on. They're only 7.5s, but Hey, I've packed Cristiano Ronaldo this year in a 7.5k pack, so it is possible. Please can we get a rare? Please can we get a board? Not a board, but it is a rare. German centre mid. Meyer. Very nice. Okay, he's going to be definitely going into our centre mid spot, guys. He's probably going to be going where Key is. I know Key just got us. Ooh, and Arias. Very nice. That is a nice pack to keep, guys. Two players that will be making appearances in Pack to the Future. Pack number two. It's not a board again. Italian, centre-back. Lazio. <laughs> I mean, it's an 82 rated player. We'll help with SBCs. I don't think I'd ever use him. 60 pace centre-back from the Serie A. But it's an 82 rated player, which is absolutely awesome. And then final pack, guys. Well, actually, it's not the final pack. We've got that silver pack to open. But final pack from the game we've just played. Not an 86. It's not 86. Can we get a board? We've got a board. Let's go. Fakir. Oh no, Payet, I beg your pardon. Dimitri Payet. Very nice. He will be our super sub, guys, for second halves. Because his passing and his dribbling are very, very nice. Payet, very, that is a nice pack. Our first 84 rated player of the series. And we've got an anchor chem style in there, which is going to go on one of our centre backs. Absolutely fantastic guys to wrap things up then let's open this premium silver pack that we have just got for our first foot swap player exchange well, our first and our last as it ends in about two hours Anyone exciting Brooks from Bournemouth? I, I tell you what that isn't actually too bad Brooks. Welcome aboard my friend Premier League so uh I will take it. But that, guys, is going to wrap things up for today's episode of Pack to the Future. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, make sure to smash that thumbs up. As I said in the intro, guys, if we could smash 1,000 likes, that would be absolutely ridiculous. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this episode. We'll be back with another one tomorrow. Till then, I'll be seeing you guys later. Take care. Peace.